Look at this fun guy we're on. Broken shower pan. And uh, there's absolutely no reinforcement underneath. Check this out. That's the concrete floor underneath that I'm hitting. So um, I've got to somehow bring this up to repair. So I'm going to do a fiberglass layup here on this side. I've pushed my, my scraper in here to to make this flat here, push it up. So we're gonna repair in a section. So I'm gonna do a fiberglass layup on here, get this nice and solid. Then I'm gonna push this up, make that nice and solid, do a, do a fiberglass layup in the crack. Then we're gonna drill holes in it. We're gonna fill it with expandable foam over the entire thing, make it super solid. If I did my expandable foam before I actually made this flat and repaired this, it would just, the, the foam would just push this up a little bit and then we'd have a big hump here. So, you know, it goes to the least resistance. So we're gonna make it straight first, then put holes, then do expandable foam, make it all rigid, then we'll finish off our body work here after we've got our fiberglass layups in. So we're just gonna grind her out a little bit, do one layup on one side, put the heat gun to it, start the repair on this side. That's it, let's get going. Got all our fiberglass layups on this thing. We pumped it full of foam. Foam's starting to get hard. So this will get like rock hard by tomorrow. But it's already it's already really really solid now. So that's good. Be a nice repair. So if it's starting to get solid now by tomorrow it'll be like a rock. it it's releasing the garbage now we're going to start doing our bondo work on top of this okay so we got our layups all done um, some of them had three layups in it some had four some had one some had two parts of it so it was one to four layups depending on how i had to build it up now we put our fiberglass filler on top of it this is like solid as a rock now this is like ultra 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 solid so now we put our fiberglass filler on it now we're going to do just regular uh polyester body filler and we're going to level out the low spot now in it, and then we're gonna put our two-part polyester filler on top of that. So we'll probably have to do one more coat on top of this, of this stuff to level it out. So we got two coats of fiberglass filler on it and we ended up putting three coats of two-part polyester on top of it. Um, and now we're gonna get ready to coat the, put the resins on this um, after I clean it. But these are kind of things I notice with people's showers sometimes. It's like, when's the last time you used your shower? Cause that's the drain. Although I think it's been cracked for many years. I pulled out a piece of hair that was between the outside of the pipe and the drain pipe in here. It's been leaking in here. Fascinating. All right, we're gonna cut the shower pan. It needs to be coated anyways. We can fix that later for them. Let's go. All right, we're all done. She's beautiful. Look at that. You'd never tell. She looks brand new. Color match is really good. It matches the toilet. We didn't do the outside, but it looks still really, really good. Recocked everything. She looks brand new. You'd never tell. Look at that. All right, we'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.